very important worldwide trends. Temperature increases are taking place all over the world. Global warming. Disastrous. In hottest years ever. Extreme climate. We pollute our Earth very much. Biodiesel fuel. Diabetes or overweight. Global epidemic. Urgent action is needed. Health is a complex issue. Health is not something just from the health sector, but it's also something from other sectors, economic sector and uh, the way we, uh, um, we organize our cities, uh, for instance. So it's a, a broad issue. Bio-based economy, it starts with biomass produced by sunlight and CO2 in water. Then we have biomass from plants. We transform that by biotechnology or sustainable chemistry into bio-based products. And bio-based economy means that we replace a part of the petroleum, what we use now in the economy, by bio-based products. If you consider that Netherlands is actually one large delta, the issues we are dealing with now in Netherlands probably will be dealt with everywhere in these zones. Then we said, okay, why don't we just develop something unique in the Netherlands? A concept, combination between technology, infrastructure, soft, and the responsibility of the, of the citizens as a kind of concept of the climate proofed Delta Zone. And this is the place where all researchers from the Dutch Knowledge Institute can come together and cooperate in a very multidisciplinary way. We see several problems, and the most important one, of course, is the depletion of freshwater sources. A uh, second uh, very important issue is the pollution of the water. And those two things are connected because a lot of compounds that are polluting the water are also very important resources for the future. If we are not able to reuse the phosphate from our wastewater as a fertilizer, there will be an enormous food problem in the future. The Food Process Engineering Group is aiming at developing really new concepts for, uh, for making foods. And we really look at innovative ways to produce foods that have extra functionality and which really offer a benefit for uh, the consumer and the producer. Really looking at what's the newest developments for actually achieving that. And bio nanotechnology is a clear development in that area. Ballenstein is a university for professional education and the main parts of our programs are animal management, coastal zone management, environmental sciences, agribusiness management and life sciences. Students are coming to Wageningen from all over the world, any continent, because here is the center of life sciences and food. Here it's happening, here is the knowledge and here you can learn everything about food and life sciences, but also environment in a broad sense. Wageningen University is a leading university in, the, in our domain. We will continue to do so when we manage to maintain our focus. My sincere congratulations to Wageningen University and Research Center on your campus and this beautiful four building, which Her Majesty the Queen will open this afternoon.
they keep those people here by, by offering very nice facilities. So they can do experiments here they can't do anywhere else in the world. That's paramount to the success of, of Wageningen University and Research Center. The Wageningen approach is a way that we believe that Wageningen can make a real contribution to global issues. The Wageningen approach means standing back and first looking at the big picture and trying to understand how science can make a real contribution to practical problems and provide practical solutions. The Wageningen approach links scientific understanding and an understanding of technological opportunities with processes of political, economic and social change. This is what we like to call science for impact. Through the Wageningen approach we believe that we can make a real contribution to helping achieve the Millennium Development Goals. These goals focus on overcoming the terrible poverty that much of humanity still suffers. Wageningen has tremendous expertise in, in these areas and we're very well placed to provide support along the whole value chain from the farmer's field right through to the consumer's fork. Wageningen cannot do it on its own. So we work for industry, industry, chemical industry, food industry, other industries. But also the NGOs are part of the deal because we have to do it together. It's not a technical solution, it's a social solution what we have to create. Public-private partnerships are absolutely uh, uh, relevant uh, also in the area of health.